Located in the middle of the Bass Strait, sandwiched between Victoria and Tasmania, the small island of King Island is home to three unforgettable golf courses. King Island, Cape Wickham, and Ocean Dunes. While traveling around Tassie, we unexpectedly received an email from our good mate, Mr. Greg Ramsey, asking us if we had plans for the weekend. Greg is the entertaining host of Ratho Farm, the oldest golf course in the Southern Hemisphere. He said that he and his mate were heading to King Island for the weekend and wanted to know if we'd like to join. Our answer was easy. Hell yeah! Getting ready for tomorrow's flight to King Island. And what do we got here? Let's see. We got our travel golf bags. Look at that. Logoed, cluttering around the world. Golf bags, stiff arms, our golf shoes, dozen balls. I hope it's enough. Packing cubes, the best things ever. I hope they are not too heavy. <laughs> all right, we're all packed and ready to go. We only have 21 kilos each including our rucksacks. Backpacks. Or backpacks. <laughs> so let's hope that it works. We're heading off to King Island for the weekend to go play golf at Cape Wickham and Ocean Dunes. And we have not a super early flight tomorrow, but kind of an early flight. So I'm sure we're not the first people to sleep in the parking lot of the airport. No. We're self-contained. We're self-contained. The only way to get to King Island, or KI for short, is via air. There are multiple flights from Melbourne, as well as Hobart, Lawney, and Burnie, Tasmania. We flew from Burnie with Sharp Airlines. We paid $970 for both of us, including our golf bags. King Island is an easy 30-minute flight from Burnie. Confused of the best Strait and the multiple tiny islands that dot the brilliant blue sea, the flight itself was incredible.
world's greatest nine-holer? Come and find out, the website boldly says. Now, when you're traveling the world playing golf, how can you resist a statement like that? With the powerful Southern Ocean as the backdrop, first up on her trip was King Island Golf and Bowling Club, located just west of Curry. So, is KI Golf Course one of the world's greatest nine-hole golf courses? That's a fair question. There's not a weak hole on the property. With mesmerizing views of the ocean on every hole, and a routing that traverses up and down a terrain that has a very true links feeling, the golf course was an absolute blast to play. After a fun round of golf, we went and explored the Curry Wharf. Located in Stingray Bay, the wharf has beautiful views of the Curry Lighthouse. Afterward, our friend Rod took us to a place called the Boathouse, which is known as the restaurant with no food. This unique and quirky place is directly on the bay and has great views of the ocean. It doesn't serve food, but you can book the Boathouse and bring your own. Cape Wickham Golf Links is located on the very remote northern tip of KI. As we arrived and looked out over the property, we could not believe our eyes. There was nothing but incredible golf and blue skies as far as we could see. Cape Wickham has fescue from tea to green, and the golf course plays tight, firm, and fast. The fairways were wide, but they narrowed where they should. And, as is true to Lynx style golf, you must land your approach shot short of the greens. It took me too long to realize this, and I was faced with many delicate chips back to the hole.
Cape Wickham was incredible and it is an absolute must play. It might be an arduous journey to get here for Aussies and especially for anyone else in the world. However, the adventurous golfer will be rewarded with one of the greatest golf courses in the world. Make the effort. We can promise you that you will be happy that you did. Besides playing top-rated golf, there are a lot of great things to do away from the course. So when you arrive on King Island, rent a car and just go explore. Things you can do on King Island are Visit the Cape Wickham Lighthouse. It is the tallest in the Southern Hemisphere. Take a sun bath at Martha Lavinia Beach, one of the most beautiful beaches in Australia. Admire the calcified forest, meander through the park Ross, and enjoy the views from the Centennial Lookout. Make sure to try the local products. King Island is especially famous for their delicious cheese. And of course, seeing the unforgettable Aussie wildlife. Located on the west coast of King Island, Ocean Dunes Golf Course is easily one of the most beautiful golf courses that we have ever seen. We were completely blown away by both the beauty and quality of golf. Ranked 15th in Golf Australia Magazine's Top 100 Courses, this was by far the most underrated golf course that we have ever played. The entire course offers stunning views that are a postcard photographer's dream, and everywhere we look, the views just seem to get better. Ocean Dunes exceeded our high expectations, and it is worth the extra effort that it takes to get here. And once you make it, we can promise you that it will be the golf course that you will brag about to your mates for years to come. King Island was so amazing and we couldn't believe what we had just experienced. Three days filled with clear skies, delicious food, friendly locals, generous hosts, and some of the most incredible golf courses we have ever played. So if you ever receive an email asking if you want to go to King Island, drop whatever you're doing and just go.
scattering around the world would like to dedicate this video to our biggest fan and super amazing nephew Simon. Thank you for all your support. We love you so much. Your Uncle James and Aunt Menekshe. We are Menekshe and James, the intrepid traveling golfers behind puttering around the world. With just our backpacks and golf clubs, we set out to travel the world. Subscribe to see where we go to next.